Nathan Evaldi having a really solid season, uh, staying pretty healthy on the year. That's very important the rest of the way. Six and four record, 220 batting average against. And Luis Robert Jr. will bat leadoff for the fourth game this season. Oh, two. Oh, and it is a strike. And Robert goes down looking one away. Andrew Benintendi, the batter. A swing and a miss. Benintendi strikes out. Back to back strikeouts for Avaldi. Six pitches, six strikes. And there's a bouncer first base. Low has it. And it's a one, two, three inning. Just seven pitches needed. Chris Flexen will take the mound. This is his 100th career start. Uh, 22nd appearance so far this season, 20th start. As Marcus Simeon, high fly ball out to left. There's out number one in this bottom of the first inning. So 108 here in the bottom half of the first, Corey Seager. And here's a drive deep into right. That one will be in amongst the people. A line drive home run for Corey Seager, his 19th of the season, to put the Rangers on top, 1-0. You're just not going to keep that guy down for long. And after getting most of yesterday off, maybe he just needed to recharge, get that body right. And he didn't want that ball to travel in the air very long. That was a home run in about two seconds. <laughs> Rangers with runners at first and second, with two men out now for Nathaniel Lowe. Payoff pitch. Ground ball, flexing, gloves it. And he gets himself out of this first inning jam. One nothing Rangers lead as we go to the top of the second inning. Andrew Vaughn stepping in for Chicago. That ball is smoked into left field. First hit of the game off the bat of Andrew Vaughn in this second inning. Had a good conversation with him today. He knows this hasn't been his best year, but he has just been ticking up ever since he started to get hot and kind of late May, early June. So here's Jimenez, right-handed batter. Didn't play in the opener of this series. Oh, Tapper out in front of the plate. Heim will take it himself. He throws out Jimenez. So there's one away. Vaughn moves up to second. That brings up Brooks Baldwin. And there's a swing and a miss. Baldwin strikes out. That's a third strikeout tonight for Valdi. Nicky Lopez will step in with two down. Ground ball to the right side, and it gets into right field. Vaughn is being waved in. Here comes the throw home. Safe at the plate. Nicky Lopez comes through with an RBI single. And we're all tied at one apiece here in the second. Nice job by Nicky to take the extra base, too. So 1-1 one, one here in the second. And here's Paul DeYoung. Swing and a miss. He gets DeYoung chasing a splitter. And that ends the inning. And there's one away here in the bottom of the second for Travis Jankowski. 3-2. He got him looking at a fastball on the outside corner. Jankowski. First strikeout victim of Flexen, two away. To bring up Leody Tavares, switch hitting center fielder. And Leody hits it hard out to right field. Fam on the run, he can't get to it. We'll take a weird hop off that wall. And Tavares around second will try for third, and that won't even be a throw. A stand up triple for Leody Tavares. So here's Simeon. 25th pitch of the inning from Flexen. And it bounces to the plate. He has walked Simeon. And now the Rangers have him on the corners. And they have their guy, Corey Seager, coming up. On the ground a second. And the Rangers strand runners at first and third. We stay tied after two here at Arlington. Here's Robert caught looking to open the game. Third straight night, he's hit leadoff. And he hits a line shot toward the left field corner. That is a fair ball and a home run. Somehow he hit it high enough. We lose sight of the ball as it gets right into that left field corner. And he tucked it just inside the yellow pole. It's two to one. There is no way when that ball left the bat from where we're sitting, I thought that was a fair ball. Smith singled in the first inning. And he dots it right on that corner. Strike three called. Nice pitch right there. Wyatt Lankford batting. He lined to center in his first trip. Swing and a line drive out into deep right center. Fam on the move. He'll run it down. Nicely done. He got a great jump. For the third straight inning, the Rangers have achieved multiple base runners. Let's see if Jonah Heim can take advantage of it with the Rangers trailing two to one. Glove by Nicky Lopez, the throw, 
And he saves the run to get the out at first. Nice play ranging. And the White Sox holding on to a one run lead after three. And that brings up Eloy Jimenez. 2 2. And Evaldi strikes him out. That's his fifth strikeout tonight. And his fifth strikeout of the night. Baldwin lifts the first pitch way out to center field. Long run for Tavares, and he'll get to it. And that completes a 1 2 3 top of the fourth. Marcus Simeon bats with two outs, nobody on. Ground ball, DeYoung with time. And a 1 2 3 inning. Chris Flexen, the first time retiring this Rangers lineup in order. Robinson grounded to short his first time up. But a swing and a miss here on a fastball from Nivaldi. Robinson is out on strikes. It's a site pro equipment rentals 1 2 3. No hassle inning. Chris Flexen comes out here in this bottom of the fifth inning. Will face Corey Seeger, who is one for two tonight. A solo home run back in that first inning. And that ball is hit deep into the right field corner. Fam back into his left. It's off the track and off the wall. It bounces over Fam. He retrieves it. Seeger's at second, thinking about third, but he puts on the brakes. Content with a leadoff double here in the home half of the fifth. Smith, the batter. Corner infielders are in. Strike three on the change. Good sequence there by Chris Flexen for out number one in this bottom of the fifth inning. White Langford 0 for 2. Popped him up. Shallow right center. And Tommy Pham will squeeze it for out number two. 100 pitches for Chris Flexen. I was like, there's no way he's going to be able to get through five. It looks like he might be able to do it. He's going to have to go through Garcia. Swinging a hard hit ball past Seeger, past Lopez into left center. Corey around third. He comes in to score. Adolis digging for two. Here's the throw. Play at second. He is safe at second base. Adolis Garcia with a hustling RBI double to tie this game at two. Adolis picking up his 48th run bat at end of the year. That will be all for Chris Flexen. So Pedro Grafol going to the bullpen here. Tie ball game. All right, the lefty Sammy Peralta just recently recalled from Triple A Charlotte coming on here to face Nathaniel Lowe. Up here, we want to see a rake. Speaking of rake, that one into center field by Lowe. Here comes Garcia, going to test another arm, and he's in there safely. And the Rangers take the lead. Lowe goes to second on the throw. And it's 3-2 to two Rangers. Luis Robert Jr. leading off the top of the six. Rangers leading 3-2. to two. The pitch, a wave and a miss. Savaldi with a splitter at the bottom of the zone he gets the strikeout of Robert and one out here in the top of the six Rangers ahead three to two and that brings up Andrew Benintendi three two swing and Benintendi skies one to short right center Tavares jogs in he's got all the room to himself and he waits for the ball to come down he makes the catch two outs Tommy Pham swing and a miss he gets him on the splitter strikeout number eight for Evaldi. So Simeon reaches that extends the inning for Seeger second walk of the game for Marcus. This ball hit hard out the right field that's going to get down base hit Simeon heading to third he'll get there easily on the two out single by Seeger and Corey is now a triple shy of the cycle. A great opportunity for the Rangers here to try and add to their lead. Men at the corners, two outs, Smith up. And that one is lined into center field. That's a base hit, a run scores. RBI single by Josh Smith, his second hit of the game, and the Rangers have a 4 2 lead. Nidavaldi out to start his seventh inning of work. Rangers leading 4 to 2. 1 2. And a strike out of Vaughn. Good start to the seventh inning. For Valdi. There are two outs here in the top of the seventh. Jimenez at second and Lopez the batter. That is strike three called and Lopez down looking. Tenth strikeout of the game for Rivaldi. Entering the pitch is the left-hander Jared Schuster. Grossman came on as a pinch hitter for Travis Jankowski in the sixth. Grossman watches one to left. That one is gone. Wow. He just jumped on that. And it's 5-2 Rangers. So the bases are loaded. Nobody out. Here's Josh Smith. And that ball's hit well. Out into right field. But he got under it. Pham racing toward the line. Almost overran it. Tagging it third. Tavares. He'll score. 
And the Rangers out a run at six to two. So now you have runners at the corners with only one out and Wyatt Langford at the plate. Here's the three two. And that's low ball four. So the bases are loaded again as Seeger moves up to second. And that brings up Adolis Garcia. The 2-2. Two -two. Bouncer shortstop. Lopez to second. One and the relay to first. Not in time. Garcia beats it out. He picks up an RBI. And it's 7-2 Rangers. Low tonight. One for three with a single, a walk, and a run batted in. 2-2. Two -two. And that ball's hit well. Deep out to center field. That's got a chance. It's gone! Nathaniel Lowe enters the chat with a three-run homer. And the Rangers have cracked this one wide open. And now, Arabito takes over in the ninth inning. The two, three, and four hitters for Chicago. White Sox are down to their final out. Andrew Vaughn will be the batter. And this one hit the shortstop again. And Ornelas got three tries in the ninth inning. And he was good on all three. And the Rangers take a laugher in game three, 10-2, the final score.